Hello guys! How are you doing today? I hope you guys are all doing pretty good. And we've got speed play with fire in Sonic Crystal. So I feel I've been listening, uh, Ninja Kiwi, to, to some things that I've said. Um, and they've started putting occasional clubs in the Ceramic Crucible. Which is sweet, man. And this guy is alright. He's got 67% and nearly nearly 600,000 medallions. So hopefully he'll be decent. Um, I tend to find you meet better players in clubs. Higher level clubs than you do in high level classic rules for some reason. Um, you occasionally do meet good players in the classic rules, but uh, very few and far between. So I'm going to show you a strategy for speed play with fire. So it's basically dart, chipper, uh, cobra, and we've got cannon as well. So basically, because it's play with fire, you get so much money. So what you want to do is eco heavily and um, basically get your defense up so you can defend. So he's gone for the uh, boomerang, which is pretty good on play with fire, but it's speed, so he's going to struggle early ish. Um, so yeah, so you want to um, eco heavily, um, build defense up as well at the same time. That's going to help you defend each round's eco because you get the you get what you send. Um, so I'm going to keep spamming triple darts, um, and then obviously round 11 because it's speed. You're going to get you can send round 13 rushes, so the regrows and stuff like that. So you need to be ready for that. Um, if I can kill these people before. Um, what I usually do on speed mega boot, speed play with fire, I will. I'll, I'll try and do that. Um, but what I usually do, let's just get that because we're starting to chase a bit, and I'm going to be starting to send greens. Sweet, it's boosted. Um, so let's just keep spamming darts. Uh, so yeah, what I'd usually do is around. I keep eco in until around round 16, and then I get a one or two. Zero four Cobras the misdirection and I put them towards where the BFBs where the scent balloons come out And then I send either one or two BFBs and then I so you'll get them as well So then I misdirect them to my opponent So they've basically either got they've got all the BFBs and you've got nothing to defend basically so I'm gonna I usually boost round eight because um, Of yellows and he's sending as well by the looks of it so I'm getting double yellows there, so it allows us to keep eco in, um, so we get a lot more money, and then um, we got plenty of money for defence. Oh no, we are going to leak quite a lot there, but never mind. Wow, we leak quite a lot. Never mind, it's all right. So we'll just keep spamming um, triple darts, and we'll be fine. We will be good, man. So we can send pinks now as well, but I'm going to have to um, get a jug just in case because he can send me leads now. And we've got a cannon and a um, chipper, but we've got so much money, it doesn't really matter. And he's not long been sending eco, he's only started in the last few rounds. So he's, we've got a lot more money than him, I believe. I think he has anyway, I'm not sure. So let's put a couple of zeros or a chippers around this jug on strong. There we go. And let's start sending, um, let's just send some of them, see if we can do out. Nope, um, he's fine. So let's just get eco, build send some blacks for eco. So let's just get some of these up to camo detection. Um, and yeah, keep sending blacks. And we've got a pretty decent defense. I might just, um, God, he's leaking quite a lot of lives actually. I might just try and take him out. Um, I mean, we've got 2k, 2k eco. Um, let's. Okay. So let's just misdirect him, and not misdirect. Um, balloon adjust. Because he's not got the best towers for balloon adjustment. Um, and we've got so much money, we can just keep spamming him until it gets too too much for him. So he's gone for a Glaive Lord, which will help out initially. But when the um, when the ceramics start coming out, it's around 17 is easy because it's just the it's just camo regular camos anyway. Um, but when round 18 hits, it's going to be um, a nightmare. As you can see, there's so many there's so many ceramics and lots of um, camo ceramics as well. This this is probably going to kill him. Um, sweet man. So the, the cobras. Um, awesome on clubs on the majority of the club battles it is pretty sweet so I mean his stats he want the best to be honest 
I was expecting him to be a bit better, but never mind. Never mind. Let's go for another one. And this guy's pretty bad, Nana. Um, so this time we will, okay, so we can do pools if he does. Nope. So speed pools is pretty insane. So patch is awesome. One of my favorites. Quite a long math though. Um, so we'll do the same, we'll take the same towers. I used to bring Ace to this, but um, you get so much money that you can Cobra's a lot better in case they do defend your misdirection strategy. Um, if they do defend against it, at least you've got Chipper. Um, and then with that, if you could start sending fast cooldowns, oh my god, you could get some 4-2 four, four, Chippers and um, a load of misdirections to um, send the BFBs over to your opponent. Um, that could be quite good. Um, let's just keep sending Eco. He's not sending. Which um, allows us to send more because we only have to deal with one set of... Um, balloons rather than both of them. If we had to, if we had to defend against both of them, we would have. There we go. So if we're sending reds, uh, but we should be all right. Yeah. If he, if he was sending blues as well, then we'd have to get spend more money. Um. So I've got that zero zero ready because we're going to be sending greens. And if he continues to send reds, greens will layer over them, and I will need probably more defense than this. Let's just get that. Um, it's a triple down and we should be good. As you can see, round four, nearly 600 eco, which is just mad. Um, so this is this is this um, speed play with fire was when I pushed for the leaderboards and got first place. It was actually uh, speed play with fire was in the BFB Coliseum, and that this was before the boss arenas and anything like that when I did that. And um, the this strategy actually got me the top basically because it allowed me to get really quick wins quicker than the classic classic rules did um, anyway especially in those days because there was a lot better people playing um, playing the game playing in arenas um, so this guy's got wizard and a helicopter so yeah we're probably gonna kill him we're probably gonna go for another round 13 around 11 it is because we're going to have plenty of Dark Monkeys, we've got a Jugs, a few Chippers, and just send him just even regular, regular Zebras are probably going to kill him. Uh, because we've got massive eco. Massive, man, insane. Oh, I forgot to change my decal. I will change it after this game, so I don't forget. Hopefully, won't forget anyway. Okay, so he started sending yellows. Uh, we're going to send white. I think he just used a boost then. Um, so these whites could trouble him, to be honest. Yeah, these whites are starting to um, cause him quite a few issues. He's actually leaking lives as well. So he's boosted. Sweet, perfect time. So we're just going to rush him. Let's get a few of these on strong because we're going to be sending. We're going to be sending regular zebras. Um, and let's just start sending them. Um, I might just boost it just to be safe. Because it's quite a lot. Yeah, let's just boost it to be safe. And that should kill him. I think he's used all his boost as well. Sweet. He looks like he's going to die anyway. 16 lives. Yep. Awesome, man. So, yeah. I'm, on this next one, I will do the misdirection strategy. So, I'll show you it. Um... Basically, yeah, like I said, just heavily, heavily eco up until around about 16, um, even 17, and then get a 0 4 Cobra, or even two if you put them both where the scent balloons are going to come out, and you can send two BFBs. When one of them comes out, misdirect it, and then because the slow cooldown, down, it'll take a few seconds, and then the next one will come out, misdirect that, and they're going to have four BFBs on their side, which um, round 18, if they're not ready, is fairly difficult to defend. Um, I guess a good players obviously they're going to defend it but if they do defend it you can sell your Cobras for four, about 4k each so you've got 8k if they counter rush you with Moabs you can get a quick fan club you um, 
can then or you, and then you can defend that and then you can switch to the offensive push if they did defend your moab class or you can wait until round 20 and then you can send fast cooldown bfbs uh, get about four get about four cobras um misdirection put them where the scent balloons come out send four fast cooldown bfbs misdirect all four and then they've got eight and then you can sell your four cobras for for eight so sixteen thousand sixteen thousand so you've got enough money to defend a counter rush as well so it does work pretty well um an ace is quite a good counter to it but the um but well obviously dark monkey and chip is a good counter to it too but the um, ace less people bring it now because it's been nerfed quite a lot and because of bloom ramping but anyway as you can see we're just sending eco i don't think he's sending uh, we're chasing quite a bit so we'll get another dark monkey um, especially for the next round because we are going to be sending um yellows Okay, and um, triple dart spam on offside is OP, so let's just bloom boost them yellows at him. I'm going to boost, so we can keep sending um, without building anything else. This allows us to get our eco up pretty high. Um, so, yeah, sweet. So, yeah, we're at 1k eco around 7, so awesome. Let's just get that up and keep sending. Still no lives lost as well. Um, let's just get that. I'll also, I might get a um, third tier cannon to help out with the eco. I'm going to be switching to black soon as well. So we've got no lead popping power. Uh, but he's not sending anything, so I'm not too worried at the minute. Um, if he does, I'll quickly can get a cannon up or, um, or even go for a juggernaut because of how much money we've got. It wouldn't really mean it matter. Let's get that. Okay, so we leaked 20 lives there. Never mind. Sweet. So, yeah, we're pretty much set now. Um, camos. We just get a few of these dark monkeys up to camo detection. Spam a few more. Get another jug. Uh, yeah, and as you can see, we're just heavily ecoing. Um, I might just stop at 2k. Um, yeah, and as you can see, our money's just building up so quick, so we can get a fan club if we need to. It's just insane. And he's got Dark Monkeys, so yeah, should be able to defend. He's not been sending me eco though, so he's not got a good eco, which is a bit foolish on Play With Fire because of how much money you can get from it. Um, but a lot of people who play it don't really understand the game at the minute, but never mind. Um, I can't remember how many, I don't think he had many medallions. Um, okay, so it's round 16. So let's just get that for these AI zebras on strong. And um, let's get a. I'm going to put it behind there. And then, if he's got the same layout as me, he won't see it. Um, and I'll, that's up to a misdirect, 04. And I'm going to send a BFB now. Wait a few seconds, and then I will bloom boost. Um, and then I will misdirect this one. There we go, and we can sell that for 4K. And he's got two BFBs, um, and he's gonna struggle with that 100%. We can get a fan club if we need it. We've got 30K in the bank, so yeah, rip mare. That's it, guys, that's the strategy. Um, let me know if you've tested this, or go give it a go. Um, and let me know in the comments if you've enjoyed this. Let's give him a thug life. Um, let me know if you've enjoyed this video uh, let me know if you want to see more clubs as well um, I'll only usually do it if they're in the high level arenas but anyway I'll see you all tomorrow